question of the day. You have 30 seconds to comment below and let me know the answer to the question. How many seas are there in the world? Go. You have less than 30 seconds now to comment below and let me know how many seas you think there are in the world. And uh, I'm looking for what international law says on this. Not, uh, not how many seas you can name or anything. Literally defined by international law how many seas there actually are in the world. Uh, be interested to see how many people wait to the end of the video to find out the answer or even Google it. But uh, that's, that's fine. Let's see. You've got less than five seconds in the left now. Comment below if you haven't done it already. And stop. Comment below, let us know, and uh, let's find out how many seas there are in the world. Well, according to international law, uh, there are in fact one sea in the world. One. It's called the sea. What? Yep, so if you said anything else, you were wrong. Uh, well, actually, alright, let me, let me explain. Okay, so the UN, which is what everybody sort of agrees around, has defined the sea as the sea. There isn't oceans or, or seas or anything like that, and uh, no one is sure exactly how many seas there actually are. So, going off the UN, which is international law, they say there is one sea. However, if you are in one of the member states that hasn't actually bothered to sign the treaty, for whatever reason, or you're in a landlocked country, like South Sudan, for example, or Kazakhstan, you can say how many seas, in, you know, you can say whatever number you want because technically you you haven't signed the treaty. But for anybody who has actually signed the treaty, any member state and anybody living in them, technically there is only one sea. Ah, politics. So there you go, guys. Question of the day. I hope you've enjoyed yourselves. Please give the video a little like or a dislike in this case. And uh, that'd be great. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye for now.